Only if like volume for he spams the fuck out of me. Think about this game, your energy, your nerves. Make sure that you you don't let them be a part of it. Try to play it one play at a time. If you do, that's when you get the best results. Dude, he's tough. Fuck with them all ways. Play clock's running down. This play call is for the fullback. Damn. Brought down at the 32. Nice run that time. You run he got his mic like out this. trying. <laughs> a time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job on the offensive line. Oh, skirm well. Second and three after that last carry. Looks like they're in press coverage here. RG3 from the gun. He's drilled as he throws. Here's the offensive line. And for this team, they are the lifeblood of the offense. When they're blocking well, this team can do some serious damage. What happened? Ooh. Third down on the way. You're dead ass. Quarters formation here for the defense. The D lines, they're seeing something on the offensive side. Everybody's shifting to the left. He's hit as he throws it. The Rams go with the pass. Damn, bro. Short. The defense was ready and they stopped the pass. Now we have a fourth down situation. Are you follow him? Yay. You yeah, okay? <laughs> the Rams will go for it here on Yay. fourth down and a short yardage situation. Ha <laughs> ha! The Rams from the 32. Yay. Has his man. He's churning ahead. Rams do a really terrific job picking up that fourth down play that time. It gives them an emotional uh, lift. And look at the defense. They are down because they gave it up. <laughs> Here they come to the 41-yard line. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. Quarterback sees something in his defense he wants to take advantage of. Griffin from the gun. Oh, That's come on, RG3. Here's a look at the defense with its ball hawking secondary. Press coverage all the way. RG3. Second down and 10. Tavon Austin, the target. Third and four coming up following that completion. Griffin in the shotgun formation. He makes the catch, taking it all the way home for the touchdown. RG3! Good start in the conference championship game. The score first gives you confidence, gives your defense confidence. Now they know what they can go out there, be aggressive, maybe take a chance, and add to that lead. Watkins gonna test the coverage this time. He got Watkins on the kick. You better take him on. Tackling him inside the 15. This is my team.
Look at that. Everybody at the line of scrimmage. The defense showing a blitz. It's a two tight end formation. And Ivory's got it on the handle. <laughs> Here's the group that perhaps has the game's biggest assignment. The offensive line. That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. Michael out of the backfield with the reception. The Vikings do a good job that time on second down. Yo, son, I'm about to fucking block this nigga, son. Vol this nigga volume is annoying. Invite someone, invite him, son. Third and short. Following the completion. Takes it from the eye. He's tackled right at the 24. <laughs> the Vikings will go for it here on fourth down and short. He'll just barrel ahead here. <laughs> Tackle down at the 24. The Rams just showed they can be dominant on defense. Well, they got the talent. Can I get a point. They have the brains too. You need both to get it done on either side of the football. But a good job of the defense that time getting off the field. The coach is going to go for it. They're changing things here. The quarterback changing. He's, he's giving the receiver some new instructions. The wide receiver shifting around in motion. Bridgewater's back in shotgun formation. Leaps in the air and has oh. it. I, think as a head coach, uh, I thought he was going to get that shit. Down, back up inside your own territory. Uh, it used to be sneak D, but it took all that shit out. You thought was going to work? It didn't. Really good field position here to start this drive. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. First down at the 21. What a catch. Touchdown. They came out firing on all This going to be an early one, fellas. Leg up in this game, even as early as it is. What a hot start for this team. What's happened here, Phil? Sharp play by the Championship. offense. That's what it's about. Man, they just came ah. out mentally prepared, and they are showing the, the defense. 180. About just executing one play after another. Watkins is gonna test. Yeah, There's only like eight here. niggas in the league. Gets out past the 20 and brought down. I thought it was I thought it was gonna be me and Q in the Super Bowl. Q lost first round. Once he lost, I was like, alright, let me pay this entry fee. If he would have won, I wasn't gonna pay. He was gonna beat me. Can't beat him anymore. Like no beating him and orders on a nickel. Like <laughs> a oh, baby. <laughs> Halfway through this first quarter now. Ivory with the catch. And Ivory's marked down after a gain of four. This linebacker <laughs> is the heart and soul of this defensive unit. The Vikings line up, split backfield. The Vikings take it from the 28. They'll mark him at the 34. Michael's a great running back to have on your football team, isn't he? He goes up in there and gets the first down. Now your offense has three more chances. First down at the 34. Michael's trying to be patient, but there is nowhere to run that time, and he only gets a short game. Second and seven on the way. Here we go. 
Second down and seven. They knocked them down behind the line of scrimmage. Rams guessed right on the defensive side that time. They thought it was going to be a run play. They were all over it, and they got it in the backfield and made the tackle. out the defense is showing a blitz here and Ivory's taking the handoff the tackles made and the first down is picked up that was a good call that time by the offensive coordinator he looks out in the field everybody's dropped back looking for pass so he took what was available and they rip off a long run that time they feed it to him one more time He's taken down at the 23. The Vikings offensive line will be whooping it up tomorrow when they watch this play in the field room. What a good job by them. Excellent planning and awesome execution. Breaking huddle at the 23-yard line. After the long game, let's see what they do here. Slashes to the left side. Nice job that time. The run play gets the first down. You move those chains. Hey, it's kind of fun to watch a team tough enough and patient enough to run the football to get these first downs instead of throwing it. it all the time. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Here they come back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. This play set up by the long gainer. The give. Power surge. Touchdown. Still a long way to go in this game. And they're able to keep it close with that touchdown. Yeah, I know there's a long way to go. But here late in the first quarter, you're sitting there thinking, how are they going to turn this around? And it is amazing in the NFL. One play can change everything. And that's what just happened. Here, shut up, son. <laughs> Keep me on law. <laughs> to continue its recent run here. They've scored the last two times they've had it, Phil. Look at it from the defensive side. What do you think they're thinking? He on the practice squad. Because everything the offense has tried so far has worked. Yeah. The Vikings defense now is going to go nickel. John Brown brings it down. The Rams' offense is still out there as we get the second quarter underway. Following that completion, second and short. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Has Austin. Austin's met at the 44. The Rams are looking good so far, Phil, and a lot of that has to do with the passing game. Griffin's been in rhythm so far today. He has been in rhythm. He is hot. Some days, Jim, when you warm up, you know you have it. And that's what happened to this guy today. When he was warming up, he had it, and he has it in the game. Throws the pass. Had it for a moment, but the ball is knocked out incomplete. Good timing by the defensive player that time. He gets to the receiver just as the football is getting there and makes the hit, knocks that football loose. Coming to the line at the 44. <laughs> Second and ten. And this goes incomplete as he was looking over the middle. Manage the football game. That's what you have to do as a quarterback. You're winning a close game and it's third and long. Well, manage it. Know what to do. Don't force the play here. If it's not there, throw it away and just punt the football. Third and ten. Has his man. Beyond the markers, it's a first down. And Austin can't hold on that time. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position. 
nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football and it leads to another incomplete pass coming to the line at the 32 second down and 10 look at that concentration as he makes the grab Griffin selling this play big time. The defense, they go for the run fake, and that's why he has time to throw the football and makes the completion. Good job. Look out. They're changing the play to take advantage of something they see on the defensive side. First down at the 16. This will be the eighth play of this drive. The corners are going to meet the receivers right on the line of scrimmage. The quarterback motions the wide receiver. Looking middle that time, and it's incomplete. That's what you expect in the NFL nowadays from the players, especially these receivers. They're so aggressive, so athletic. They go all out for every catch. That time, he just lets it all go. Not able to make the catch, but I'll give him an A for effort. It's intercepted! you got to stay aggressive on the defensive side. That time, the defense did. Even though the offense was going in to score, they finally they come up with the big play, and they get the interception inside their own 20-yard line. <laughs> the Vikings will look to get set. Been a close game so far. The scores, 14 to 7. Takes it from the strong eye. Here, shut Always up. Good to have these types of runs. Hey, it's not a first down, but it's I don't know. Efficient. I'll get it, it back. I don't care. You can run it when you want to, and also it opens up so many other things for your offense. Second and four. Tackle, but not until he picked up the first down. Ivory's a very smart runner. He knows situations in the game. He saw the first down yard markers, and what does he do? He gets past them and picks up the first down. First and ten. And here's the toss. That picks up about three. Michael's never able to build up that power that he has as a running back when there's nowhere to go. Hey, there's nowhere to go. That's a short game. It's now second down and seven after the three-yard rush. Gets the handle here. Picks up about two. Michael's a dangerous runner when you give him room to run, but there is no room this time. What a job by the defense. They bottle him up for a short game. Now looking at third down. Vikings need to get to the 35 to pick up a burst. Quarterback likes what he sees out there outside. He's changing the play with the wide receiver. The Vikings will take the snap from the 30. Golden Tate on the receiving end. This is one of those guys, when you talk about receivers, no matter what, he is always open. If the coverage is tight, don't worry. Throw it out there. He'll make a play. Bridgewater's five for five after that completion. First down here after the completion. Trying to power his way right up the middle. Here, he ran a fucking drag, like... So annoying. <laughs> God, <I mean>, shit. <laughs> Play number six coming up on this drive. Second down and seven. We'll run it with him again. And now we'll be on the other side of the 50 after this play. Grabbing the face mask. We see it almost once a week, and here it happens again. Well, a lot of times these defenders, I'll give them a, you know, a little slack because they're running so fast. They're trying to tackle some tremendous athletes in open space. And sometimes, accidentally, you're going to grab the face mask.
coming to the line at the 34. The Vikings come out with a split backfield. The Vikings have it at the 34. Running right through the trenches. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Second and ten. He's going to get another carry. They are all over him behind the line of scrimmage and a loss of one. It'll be third down. Quarterback, he's changing the play with the wide receiver with those hand signals. They motioned the receiver around to the other side. Third and 11. The grab is made by Ivory. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. The Rams, one timeout remaining. Walsh set now to attempt the field goal. is good it's good phil how about the kick here before no. the intermission what does that do for this team well jim i think it puts them in a good frame of mind it was a good drive by the offense so that's got to give them confidence and anytime you're close to going to halftime you got to be you got to be happy about that johnson's in on the tackle the rams offense back on the field trying to make up for that costly mistake the last time they had the ball the turnover they committed immediately turned into points against them yeah, it did, Jim, but you know what? It's not a perfect game. you got to deal with adversity if you're talking about football. So you made that mistake. Let it go and go out there. Be aggressive and see if you can score some points. Griffin's going to take it from the gun. Has the grab. Brought down at the 26. That short pass play picked up six. It's now second down and four. Well, we got a close game here right before half. Good job by the offense deciding to go in the hurry-up offense. What you need here, as many plays as you can get, and use up as little time as possible. They're going to the hurry-up offense, and they're back to the line quickly. Finds his mark. They'll mark him at the 28. That's his first reception today. Griffin's able to show off the footwork. Wow, what a good job. Look at those feet. Like a dancer. Gets himself in very good position to throw the football. First down and 10. Griffin's now going to leave the pocket and tuck it under. And it's incomplete. Well, the defense has got to love that. They love it when a quarterback is uneasy for whatever reason or just not in rhythm. That time they see him throw off the back foot and the throw goes incomplete. The Rams take it from the 28. RG3 going down the field. And it's incomplete. Got to give the defense a lot, of, a lot of credit there, don't you, Jim? They are all over the receivers, all over the field, nowhere to throw it, and it just results in an incompletion. The offense now needs to pick up the first here on third down after that incomplete. It's not an open bear. Shut up. Griffin's got it in the gun. Scans the field. Can't hold on here as it goes incomplete. Got to give this secondary credit in this passing. Oh, you need a party. Plays, but a good play there and another incomplete pass. What? The kick is good. The teams head to the locker room, and we'll be heading to the studio to our pal Larry Ridley. I missed anyway. Watch the NFL on EA Sports.
Watkins running this one out. And they're all over him at the 18-yard line. The Vikings will be trying to make it three successful drives in a row as they retake the field here on offense, partner. They got a great feeling from the offense so far. In other words, they're confident, they feel good, so you need to keep calling plays. It keeps the, the offensive players in a Take it off. frame of mind. You do that, hey, I wouldn't be surprised to see him march down here and score again. Has space. Bridgewater's met at the 44. The Vikings look pretty confident out there on the field, don't they? And they're, they're very calm, and they should be. That first down, they're right in this game. What don't has he been doing to expose these? Just yeah. keep marching. Colin Kaepernick under center. The Vikings have it at the 44. Swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Coming up, second down. Here comes the wide receiver in motion. Here's the handoff. Wide to the left. Breaks free. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. He's now over 60 yards rushing on the ground. They're able to move the chains after that last run. doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals now first and ten has his target and that gains one that's what you call a bullet pass very little space to throw the football into <laughs> it done. a lot of velocity Right on target. Bridgewater's seven for seven with that completion. Second and nine. They'll go ground. And they tackle him down at the 37 yard line. Michaels trying to be patient, but there is nowhere to run that time, and he only gets a short game. Still five yards short of a first after the run. Third down coming up. The Vikings from the 37. And Ivory's got it and a first. The Vikings just picked up a big first down that time, Jim. When you're down in the second half, every first down is crucial. Nice job that time by the offense. To the ground. And Ivory's tackled right at the 20. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Second down, four to go. Still powering ahead. Smashes to the left side. Next snap will take place at the 19. Michael lined up in the backfield. Takes it the distance for the touchdown. And by getting it into the end zone, they've evened the score with just about a quarter and a half still to play. Yeah, nice job. Wasn't that, Jim? That was fun to watch and to see this team under the pressure trying to find a way to tie it up. And they come through and they get it done. Exciting stuff. He'll have a chance to take off. And the tackle is made right around Here, lead a the 26-yard line. The Rams offense will try to set the pace early here in the second half. With this Get the game fuck tied, out. Phil. Yeah, they're going to try to set the pace. But, listen, on the other side, this defense is aggressive. It's tough. 
I think the defense is going to get after him and maybe cause a turnover right here. Locked in on the football and has hold of it with two hands. The Rams have been quite good all season at throwing the football. No one's in double stack. Shut up. Like today. Griffin's been efficient. He's been finding his targets. I seen your audibles. He is showing why he's one of the better quarterbacks in the NFL when you take Yo! Tackles made midway through the third and this defense has given the, the opportunity to seize command all they have and listen i think right now you get to this time of the game midway through the third quarter it's time for the kind of throw to is that of an opportunity and go out there and make a play if they do that that's going to go a long I got way no one else first down at the 49 Here's the handoff. Battle strong. I'm trying to throw the low in volume. This has got to be a blitz. Look how everybody's crowding a lot of scrimmage. Second down and 13. Got a flag. The defense will take the penalty. The Vikings running back that time. He makes a bad decision. You can't be looking to make every play a big play when you're running the football. Look for a few yards. Take advantage of that. He tries the big play. What happens? He gets tackled for a loss. They bring in the extra tight end. Bridgewater standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. And that gains a few. When you run that drag route across the field, it is not as easy as it looks. You're running fast. You have to catch the football right in stride, and you cannot see what's in front of you. Let's see if they can complete another one. This time, perhaps, for the first down. Third down coming up. The Vikings snap it at the 41. And he hauls it in. Got a flag. He's in the clear. The 10. He's in for the touchdown, but there is, there is a flag down. Now we're talking about some of the fastest humans on earth. And we take into account you can't touch them or breathe on them. That's how they're able to get open and make so many catches. The quarterback's picked up on something. He's changing the play here. Third and long. A juke ruined the game. That us, son. Vikings don't have a lot of options on third and long situations. The pass goes incomplete, and the defense did a good job of staying back there and not giving up the deep throw. Bear. He's not even throwing to him. Shut up. That's a touchback, and the ball will be spotted at the 20. The Rams bring their offense back onto the field here, trying to avoid a repeat of the mistake on their last drive, which was. Bear, he's not winning. Shut up. Yeah, you're looking for a way to get that momentum back. And how do you do that with a good play call on first down? Catch the defense off guard. Get some momentum on the offense. Give your players confidence so they can let it go. Playing press coverage to the outside. Time for the hurry up offense. Bear, stop saying that. No one's in that. Like, shut up, son. First and ten. All right, so stop saying double stack. Like, he's scanning the field. Who Yo, where is his fuck? This nigga's corners just be free. That leads us to second down. Quarters formation here for the defense. RG3 from the gun. Sucks. The Rams now moves the chains. That's another reception, giving him two. Good route that time by the receiver on the out route. Nice throw by the quarterback. This is what they call a timing this route. Love well, quarters. No. Now 
guy's going to change the play and look out. I think he's going to go down the field with the football. It's caught by John Brown. Second down after that pass play. No need to huddle. Hurry up offense. Griffin from the gun. Brown's got the catch and the first. Looks like they're in press coverage here. First down at the 31. Looking across the middle. Picks up about five. Yeah, he's not giving that up, so like, ever. He has the capability to get open. I think it's an understatement saying he's getting talking about he gonna get no help. Everything he do himself, nigga being quarters like hear that shit. And incomplete. What a hit that time. That's interesting. As you watch the receiver trying to make that catch, he knew the defender was close, so he didn't put all of his heart into it. The defender made a nice hit and knocks the football out to the ground. Griffin's going to take the snap from the shotgun. John Brown has the catch. Yeah, everyone. They're going to the hurry. Because that shit is too hard. I've tried that shit before to come down on a drag and tap. Like, that shit is too hard. Man. Griffin's yeah. Yeah. You... Shotgun formation. Makes the catch. Yeah. Another first down. They are just making one solid play after another and just marching down the field. First and goal. Just the Rams. What up six? Still a lot of game to go, but they've taken the lead on that touchdown. Oh, man, that's awesome. Anytime you take the lead in the fourth quarter, that is a huge deal because we're talking about... It's just, you're saying shake, bro. Limited time on the play clock. This is the best <laughs> I remember you surrendering that, though. Watkins is going to run this one out. And he's out across the 20. We're in New England or... What? The Vikings offense coming back onto the field here. Desperately he bringing that shit fucking like one oh, game we play. Like, I'll tell you what, if they go three and out again, you know what? Bear, no, you don't, son. Looking at them as they come off the field. You put this back out there already, so it's important to get a drive, give your defense a little rest. For a gain of about five. He's now over 80 yards rushing on the day. The Vikings snap it at the 26. Tackles Who over there? The first down is picked up. The Vikings did a good job that time picking up the first down. Let's look at the situation. You're behind the second half. You keep looking to pick up those first downs, and you know you get enough of them. What does it do? Pretty simple. It leads to a score. Has his target, and that's a gain of maybe five. Jim, here in the fourth quarter, when you're down, what you want to do is just keep that football moving. That time it's a short throw, he gets a completion. Good job. Bridgewater's completion percentage, 90% on the day. Got the completion. Tackles made, and that'll move the chains. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. They're trying to confuse the offense here. Look at everybody crowd the line of scrimmage. First and ten. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. Then picks up about three. Jim, that's a nice job by the offensive coordinator there, being patient here in the fourth quarter. He's not down that much, so he's sticking with the run game and gets a short run that time. Second down and seven. Now they take the okay, bear onto the opponent's side of the field. Defense wasn't fooled by that play call. The defense, even though their team is leading, they were ready for the run, and they stopped the offense that time just for a couple yards. This is a time where the quarterback has to manage the clock, has to be very careful. Trailing, needing points to get back into this one. I think in a situation like this, it's fourth and short, near midfield, fourth quarter, you're down a few points. I, I think you go for it. This is a decision where odds are on your side, take a chance, get that first down, and maybe you can drive down the field and take the lead. Time 
is running out. The defense knows it's playing with the lead, but doing well ah! to just try to run out the clock. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Press coverage all the way. First down and ten. And Ivory's going to take the handoff now. We've hit the two-minute warning in the second half. play is huge now second down on the way just about two minutes to go and the defense knows it needs to make one last stop to end it another handoff right back to him runs to daylight for the touchdown how about the blocking up front lets the running back get in the secondary and he is so quick and elusive he avoids the tackles and takes it all the way for the touchdown. Add the extra point. The kick is good. The Vikings ready to boot the football down the field. That'll be a touchback. And the ball will be placed at the 20. The Rams heading back onto the field on offense. They scored on their last drive, Phil. And they did it with a blistering aerial attack. Quarterback is hot. He is getting protected. Oh, man, what do you do now? I think if you're an offensive coordinator, it doesn't matter what you call. You know your guys are going to make it work. And the immediate handoff to the fullback. Second down and 11. The catch is made by Tavon Austin. Here's the first snap after the big play. Handoff made. Advance the ball onto the other side of the field. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Griffin in the shotgun formation. Got the completion. Third catch today so far. The Rams have been involved in a highly competitive game here today, and it's been their passing attack that has come through. Griffin's had a strong performance, and it's why this game is tied up at this point. Yeah, a couple things you want to talk about about this game so far here today. The quarterback has been outstanding. He's made good decisions, but the offensive line, my gosh, they are giving him time, and he is taking advantage of it. We are tied, and this game has less than a minute to go. The Rams from the 37. Gets it out for the completion. That's a gain of eight. The Vikings will, of course, call the timeout now to stop the clock. It's third down coming up. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Griffin's going to take it from the gun. He climbs the lap and a take it home for the touchdown. Damn, I just got veiled the, the fuck out, man. I had no one open. <laughs> no one open. That ain't no aggressive catch, though. That's just a veil out. <laughs>
The Vikings are ready to return the kickoff. No! <laughs> I think he's going to be a man. Past the 20 and brought down at the 23. The Vikings offense comes out here desperately looking to put the drive together. Oh, God, eh. Chance here late to win this game. Always the tough thing to do in a situation like this for the offense. I should have been a faggot and dove and fucking took the field goal. Now he going to score and go for two. Here we go. Get this drive started by doing the right thing. First down. Fear. No. Every snap now. Fuck you. Bridgewater's got the gun. Jordan Cameron with the catch. He's taken down at the 42. The Vikings signal for the timeout, and they have none remaining. Now on first down. Every snap crucial the rest of the way. Quarterback sees something in his defense he wants to take advantage of. First down at the 42. And it's on target with Kyle Rudolph. The Vikings are at the line and they are out of timeouts. The wide receiver in motion. First down at the 48. Nope, that's down. Beasley. No, the defender tips it out. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. He would have had no, my corner would have called him. He had no timeouts. The Vikings head to the line and out of timeouts. They'll send it back to the quarterback out of the gun. Can't find the target. Here, the that corner.